most people don't take too kindly to rats. Then again, most people haven't met Riff Rat. His adoptive mom rescued him off the streets when he was just four weeks old. When people heard about her plans, they were skeptical. That's because she already had another pet, a dog named Osiris. Dogs may be loving creatures, but they're not exactly known for their fondness of rats. In fact, some breeds were originally bred specifically to hunt them. However, Riff Rat was lucky. His canine companion wasn't like other dogs who might delight in terrorizing tiny rodents. There was something quite different about Osiris that made the perfect friend for Riff Rat. The three-year-old Dutch Shepherd also happened to be a therapy dog, which might explain why he was so much more patient than other dogs. It was Osiris's job to be sweet and nurturing, especially to other animals. Even with a trained professional like Osiris, precautions had to be taken. Osiris was still much bigger than the little rodent. Thankfully, Osiris and Riff Rat bonded almost immediately, and they formed a connection like no other. They're pretty much inseparable these days. Look at Riff Rat taking the opportunity to sneak up on his best bud and give him a miniature smooch, square on the lips. How sweet is that? When not snuggling, they ham it up together for the cameras. These two might not understand what the camera even is, but they certainly know when they're in front of one. Clearly, they waste no time relishing the spotlight. Doesn't this look like it could be a poster for a movie about a quirky pair of animal friends out on a quest for a missing slice of cheese? Who wouldn't pay to see that? Osiris and Riff Raff made for quite a pair. Osiris has helped foster and care for dozens of animals, and he's like the gentlest dog I've ever met, their owner said. Looking at an image like this, it's impossible to believe that Osiris could ever have a mean bone in his body. Riff Rat really likes licking the inside of Osiris' mouth, added their owner. I'm sure you're all wondering if we're afraid that Osiris will eat Riff. Nope. Though unlikely friends, these two couldn't be more affectionate with one another. Some folks might be skeptical when they first hear how well these two get on. To be fair, have you heard of a rat and a dog becoming best friends quite like these two? Thankfully, these photographs act as proof. Their owner also happened to capture this strange habit of riff rats on film. Osiris seems quite delighted with his little pal's fondness for dentistry. And to think, riff rat didn't even go to dental school. Just look at how sweetly Osiris is thanking Riff Rat for his top-of-the-line dental cleaning by sharing one of his favorite toys. His favorite amateur doggy dentist deserves nothing less than a good chew toy. If Riff Rat had ever minded getting sloppy thank you kisses from his bestie, he certainly doesn't show it. In fact, it looks like he might be relishing every second of this very slobbery greeting. Clearly, these two animals have developed a very special relationship. Heck, it practically seems like they spend every single day just showering each other in love and affection. Osiris loves Riff Rat so much, he just can't help but cover him head to tail in kisses. For Riff Rat, though, this isn't love that he's getting from his favorite dog. It's also a regular bath. Although Riff Rat loves Osiris just as much as Osiris loves him, unfortunately, his tongue isn't quite long enough or large enough to fully reciprocate, but his sweet little smooches definitely make Osiris happy nonetheless. Riff Rat likes to be in pockets, says his owner, and it certainly seems that way. If he can't be with his buddy Osiris, he will do just fine provided he's tucked inside a warm denim pouch. However much Riff Rat likes pockets, he definitely likes Osiris much, much more. It's amazing how gentle and patient this pooch is when it comes to hanging out with his much smaller friend. Seeing them care for each other and have such an unexpected friendship gives me a tiny bit of hope for the rest of the creatures on this planet, especially humans, says their owner. It's hard to disagree.